Hello everyone, Vintage Fire Alarm Guy, happy Fire Alarm Friday. Today we're doing System Test 24. Yep. And like I said, panel, if you already know, nothing's wrong, so I'm probably not going to continue saying anything about the panel because the panel's all normal, so, alright? So, anyway, let's go on with our uh, initiating devices and notification appliances. So, over here I have a Fenwall rebranded FCI MS2. Yep, you can see this one is a fire suppression system release. You see, brand Fenwall. Fun fact, it takes an FCI, it just takes a regular FCI key. Um, I don't know why, but it just does, so. Yep. All right, so that's the first pull station on the system. Over here, I have the Ansel SLG24F smoke replaced the 2400 from last test. And then over here, I have, I still have the Siemens pull from last test, so. This hasn't swapped out from last test, so, yep. So, yep, that is our initiating devices, and now, notification appliances, aka the alarms. Up here, I have a, um, it is a Walter Kitta fire alarm bell. Um, I'm not exactly sure what the model of this is. Um, if any of you guys know the model of these bells, um, you guys can drop a comment down below and ask what kind of bell this is, so, yep. So that is the first notification appliance on the system. And then over here, uh, we have a Flight Quench rebranded Federal Signal 450D uh, fiber tone with the valve strobe on the front or VisaAlert strobe. Yep. The model of this is 20-051 with a 20-047 uh, strobe on top of it. So. Yep, so right here we have kind of like a, it's like a agent release, um, halon release, uh, polarized suppressing kind of system. So, yep, that's pretty much that. And also, for the funnel, F for the funnel we branded FCI MS2, I got this from uh, Fire Alarm Dude 5967. Yep, shout out to him. So, we did this in a trade. Um, he gave me a Fenwall pole and the uh, 2400 smoke, so. Thank you very much. So, but yeah, so that is the devices and all that stuff. And now for the activation. So, we will start off with the um, activating the system. Start off with the fun wall pulsation. If you have epilepsy, do not watch. Here it goes. As you can see, we have audible silence for this device, so, yep. And so like I said, there's some strobe over there. It's just only just the bell over there, so, yep. All right, so we can reset this. All right, reset. Now, reset the system. All right, so now we will do the Ansel smoke. If, for some reason, I can get all this magnetic stuff off my magnet, Okay, I don't know what the heck happened there, but... <laughs> yep. Alright. And now for the Ansel smoke detector. Here we goes. Here we go. Pretty cool, eh? Alright. Now... For the last initiating device on the system, the um, Siemens pulse station. So, anyway, here we go. Go ahead and reset this. So, all right. 
All right. Yeah, sometimes these poles are a pain to reset with one hand. So, I mean, they're not always, but I mean, they are sometimes. So, all right. All right, look at that one shot. All right. Now, that was all our devices. Now we can do a system reset. All right. So that pretty much wraps up for system test 24. Yep, fire, um, agent, hang on release devices. Yep, it's pretty cool. I'll tell you what. <laughs> yeah, and also one more thing. Um, if you all remember the last test, Yes, I did use this horn last test. Apparently, this was on. The, this had the same pitch like my 93 a for no 93 three. Sorry about that. Yeah, but apparently, I could barely hear the vibratone because of the do the loud 93 three and all that stuff. So that's why that's why you guys couldn't really really hear this too well because 93 three was way too loud. So, yeah. but at least now you can hear what this thing actually sounds like. So, yep. All right, but. Anyway, that pretty much wraps up for this video. If you all enjoyed this video, give a big thumb, give this video a big thumbs up, drop a comment down below, and of course, subscribe to the channel.